Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Stellaris. Let's uh, get this show back on the road. Uh, as a reminder, in the last episode we got battleships. Uh, if I bring up the uh, the fleet manager, we're saving up so we can get the last one. Uh, we've got a couple of things we can upgrade Research concluded. over here, but I'm not really not really pushing to get that done before we get the, uh, the battleship done. Gateway travel! So there's a gateway over here. That would be very, very interesting. Uh, phase disruptors would also be great because they're penetration. But I think this is this is going to be the biggest one. Go for the rare technology. We'll really like hammer it home. Uh, in terms of what's actually going on with our various ships, uh, our construction ships can't do that much, uh, which is a, a bit of a shame, but... Fleet enhancement supplied. There we go. You guys are coming down to Hicklam. Do we want you down at Hicklam? I suppose we kind of do. Yeah, with with this res aliens here. I think we're going to want to to go in and, and have a look at them. But obviously we'll wait until both both sets of uh, fleets have arrived now while we're traveling through these uh, these different areas we're offering uh, suffering from uh, environmental hazards and that's uh, directly changing the uh, the relative power of our fleets that's really cool to see actually if you've got uh, something like uh, this uh, this place with shield nullification, you can build your ship specifically around that. All right, so it's in session. This is for uh, natural sanctuaries. Oh, we're supporting it, I suppose. I probably... Oh, these guys are in breach of galactic law. I wonder what we can do about that. I mean, I'd, I'd like better sanctions. Yeah, you know what? We'll we'll propose sanctions for for everything. Now oh, we've got a pending resolution, so until ours goes in, there's not a great deal we can do about that. All right, that's fine. Uh, this one we are opposing. Yeah, that's good. Minor military sanctions. It's it's good. All right, so you guys are here. We'll just wait for the other other team to come along. I suppose we can uh, we can sell a little bit of food, can't we? In terms of planets and sectors, these two are Arctic, tropical, tropical, tropical. Yeah, we've we've done all of that. All right, so I think we're yeah we're just waiting on those uh, those alloys. I could sell things and uh, perhaps we can we can sell some exotic gases. Oh geez, we can sell yeah, we can sell some exotic gases and get a whole bunch, whole bunch of money. Uh, sell those as well. So we can easily afford that, and then we can go fleet manager, 
reinforce. Just to make sure we don't fall foul of the Military Readiness Act. That's very Research important. Concluded. Uh, over here, you're going to get both of those upgraded. Get that supplied. upgraded. Let's have a look at the Fleet research. Enhancement supplied. Leader enhancement selected lineages. Okay. Uh, we're once again full on our influence. That's fine. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. So, new research. Deep Space Black Site. Produces unity and stability. Okay, that's an interesting one. Uh, I think we'll, we'll go for improved starbase capacity though. Uh, diplomatic weight from economy up. No, I don't want to pose that. Right, how how is our economy looking compared to everyone else? Uh, one seven eight seven. Well, actually, we're slightly better than everyone else. So let's support that. Habitability goes down a little bit, but we can. We can deal with that. All right, with with both our fleets here, as soon as we've got that reinforcement, I can send them in. I don't want to do it before then because we might just, you know, get beaten for no reason, um, or at least suffer damage. Yeah, we don't have a special project for these res aliens. I think we'd actually have to go in and interact with them. Dangerous. Dangerous. Uh, what do you guys like? Yeah... We could we could outlaw purges to bring these guys in line. Yeah, let's let's do some policy changes. Uh, right. So, where's our policies? Uh, don't care so much about those. Refugees, all refugees are welcome. Purging should be stopped. That instantly brings them up. Uh, how about you guys? Uh, no, we're not restricting defensive stance, but we will get some money, so they're gonna they're gonna become happy as well. And this is this is mostly just to make people in general across our system happier. Research concluded. All right. Let's uh, pick another one of these. Star Fortress. Ooh. Alloy Mega Forges. Mm -hmm. Let's go weather control systems because that'll be a quick one. Looking at it, we've got some other buildings that we can uh, we can get going. And there's, of course, a whole bunch of different upgrades. Uh, so let's see. There's... There's no housing available here. We can have one more district. Uh, the housing will resolve itself. So really, I want to look at what's going to be most useful here. We've got six exotic gas coming in, three volatile motes, and three rare crystals. Could get alloy foundries. Hmm. 
mineral purification plants. Also not a terrible idea. Or we could get another research lab. Here, let's let's get another research lab. And we can upgrade this to an advanced research complex as well. And we'll we'll leave it at that for for the home world. Over here we are out of housing, so let's let's get a new district. And maybe an yeah, this is a bureaucratic centre, so let's let's keep to that. We'll go for more admin offices. Down here on Fuldora. I would like to get this upgraded. We've got five housing. We've got one available job. Yeah, it's definitely time to upgrade the ship shelter. And it'd be nice to, uh, yeah, get some goods. All right, we'll we'll wait until we've got some more uh, some more stats. Right, these these two are all ready. Let's uh, send them in and have a nose around. Do right, you know what? Let's get them both to go to here first. Mmm. Broken a migration treaty. Yeah, I'm going to let them actually catch up with each other. And then we'll see what goes on with this. Come here, guys. Oh, they are zippy. Okay. Let's go after them. Initializing hostile engagement protocols. Wow. That, like, absolutely murdered them. Okay, I need one of my science ships. Which one is going to be the closest? So you're in Dogmar. Uh, you're all the way back at Anak, and you're on Haldus. So Dogmar is closest. Come and research this, ah, uh, and then we're going to send you straight back. Uh, yeah, what's Dogmar Prime? should have been uh, helping with. Man, our ships are fast. Okay, let's uh, let's see what this is. Yeah, it's a amoeba bits. Uh, for combat, the space amoeba basically had nothing that they could do. I love our little ships. I mean, we, we could just start absolutely nuking these guys. But let's not. The vessels are quite worrying over there. We'll, we'll pull back over here. We've, we've done our job. Research concluded. Uh, we might have a few repairs to do, actually. No, no, everyone everyone got off scot-free. All right, city district housing increased. That's definitely something that we want to consider. 
more cruiser hull points, make them even bigger. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do the housing first. We're up to the point where we can get a building going over here. Uh, Haldus Secundus is a tech world, so Haldus Secundus is going to get another research lab. Cool. Uh, so leaders gained level. Education edict has expired. Let's uh, get that going again. Every everything is expensive all the time. Ooh, volatile explosives, volatile ammunition, volatile land clearance. They're all very cool things. Um, I don't think we really care about any of those. No, we'll, uh, we'll leave that alone. Right, for the tradition, uh, we were in prosperity. Buildings and districts have their build cost reduced and build speed increased, or city districts provide one additional clerk job. That's useful. Specialist population resource output is increased. Well, specialists are amazing because they're like the corner state of our economy and research and basically everything else we're doing. Another day, another scientific breakthrough. Oh, gateway travel. Oh my god, that happened so quickly. Uh... Improved React Booster will be done in five months. We'll just get that ticked off. You. Uh, that requires upgrading. So we can't use that gateway. All right, good to know. I wonder, down at Cybrex Alpha, we can we can repair these hostile fleet in OSEC crap so this is Gamma Aliens. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Are they coming towards the station? They are. I mean, the station's... Spaceport's sustaining damage. The, space, uh, the station is big enough that it should be able to defend itself. Uh, I think we need... Some more of these. Uh, one, two, three. You know what? Get four more. Another day, another scientific breakthrough. Oh, that is really starting to hurt. They're down to two and a half K. We are taking pretty heavy damage. Uh, right, we need to get more research on the go. Research Institute? Yeah. I think we're gonna lose it. Oh no! It did really well. To defend it. Huh. One of the uh, the platforms finished building. For what it's worth. Hey, natural sanctuaries has been passed. So what are you guys doing? If they're just waiting here, I'm fine with that. 
I will come and wreck them just as soon as the fleet arrives. Where are you guys? Oh, you're so far away. Research concluded. Another defense platform is finished. Okay, we're going to go for the Star Fortress. This thing is, of course, going to take a long time to get repaired. Research concluded. Starbase capacity increased. Awesome. Um, let's go genetic modification. I need you guys to be here much faster. 146 days. You know what, come just to here. Hey, we killed another ship. So this is this is actually kind of worthwhile. We're losing a lot of defensive platforms doing this. But it's good to know that they are actually doing something rather than just basically being wasted. Receiving transmission. Uh non-aggression pack? No, don't care. Technology researched that I do care. Let's uh Yeah, let's get the X-ray laser. Over here we have a specialist who is unemployed. Yeah. Let's get research labs. We'll also get generator district. Yeah, we'll get two generator districts. Can always have extra money. Okay, it is go time. Yeah, it's down to just the, the pants things. I mean, this is going to be overkill. So much overkill. Okay, you guys are now going to wait by the wormhole. Uh, did you not? I thought I told you to come down here. And then to go back over here. In the meantime, you can come and do this, and then we'll send you back to Haldus Secundus after. So the Amoeba Swarm, they... Uh, obviously damaged our space station, but the space station did a really good job of holding everything off. We definitely want defensive platforms back on it. Um, so, thinking about it, this is going to be a good time for us to sell some of our extra resources. And just buy a whole ton of these. One, two, three, four, five will do.
Research concluded. Star Fortress. Go all the way to a citadel, maybe? I mean, if you're gonna go big. 22 months, yeah. Thanks to recent advances in genetics, we have gained an extra trait point that we can use Ooh. to modify and enhance our people. Okay. Uh, so, with gene modification, that's going to be a thing. Ooh. Yeah, let's, let's find out about the amoeba bits. Um, so that's from the OSEC system, this one. Uh, amoeba breeding program and society research. So it's, a, it's tiny, tiny amounts. How are we going to change our species? No, the down species here. screen lists all types of nominally intelligent beings we have encountered. We can toggle species to display only citizens of our empire or all known denizens of the galaxy. Okay, the question then... Modify the traits of the species, okay. We can genetically engineer this species, modifying their traits. Oh, we can change the planet preference. So we could have Arctic preference. Ah, we need a glandular accelerator. So we've got one trait point. But zero trait picks. Ah, I see. So we might be able to remove one of these later. Okay, we, we won't do that just yet then. I'm learning, I'm learning. Yeah, and speaking of learning. Hmm. Research concluded. Uh, yeah, actually. Let's uh, let's explore the wormhole. A particle lance. Oh my god, that's that's pretty big. Uh. Yeah, we'll get particle lances. I'm going to send one group through. Space storm feathers have arrived. Massive subspace disturbances have erupted in systems across the galaxy. Early reports indicate that nearly 50% of the systems in the galaxy have been affected by this unprecedented phenomenon. Which appears to be a byproduct of thousands of years of heavy hyperspace travel by civilizations both past and present. Scientists are confident that this galactic space storm will dissipate by itself within 5 to 10 years until that happens. The storm will play havoc with sublight engines, shield generators, and sense systems. Those star systems are in. The galactic community has officially named the storm Feathers of and has issued a general travel advisory. Wormhole in Osec has been explored. It connects to the Shiat system. Okay. Where is... So that's the Merc system. That's the Angtar system. Uh, yeah, we want them on aggressive. Ah, oh, click to focus on the other side. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, well that's that's not terrible. It's a very good way of fast travel. So actually, 
you guys stay here. I don't need you to travel through. Right. So leaders gain the level. Wormholes being explored. Sure. That's useful to know. The Senate is in session. This is for the Minor Military Sanctions Act. I'm glad everyone's voting on my one. As soon as this passes, we can pull in more sanctions. Um, yeah. You know what, we'll send one of you back down here. I'm wondering if I should explore more wormholes. Yeah, let's... Um... Let's explore that wormhole. We'll figure out what it is and, and what's going on. Hostile vessels nearby. That's not... Oh, damn, that's, that's going to be bad. Right. Uh, we need... Some defensive platforms here. So much for saving up for uh, for reforming that ring world. Research concluded. All right. Amoeba flagella. So it's a ah, it's a strike craft. By breeding space amoebas in captivity, we can program their symbiotic flagella to act as organic strike craft. Absolute genius. Uh, yeah, let's. Uh, ooh, that looks very cool. Let's, uh, let's go for the Galactic Administration. We've got quite a few volatile moats still coming in. guys all assisting research yet yeah, assisting research assisting research assisting research uh, actually you can you can get yourself upgraded and then once you've done that go back you can get yourself upgraded which does mean turning around of course uh, but then we'll get you to explore this after. This feels cool, we're having space battles! Combat! I'm quite tempted to upgrade some of our stations just to make them a bit more defensible. Oh, that's Gertrand, yeah. Fleet enhancement supplied. Gertrand's definitely getting upgraded. Uh, we've got five housing, but we've got no jobs for these guys. Yeah, let's upgrade to a better research complex. That'll sort that out. Leaders gain level, leaders gain level. We need amenities. Yeah, that's just... Admin capacity... A commercial zone. That'd be fine. We'll get another generator district as well.
it's tempting to head down and kind of invade this place uh, so we can get them eliminated. Fleet enhancement supplied. Lovely. Alright, so they're on their way back. Got to defend our borders. In fact, over here. I want at least one more. Anyone sends a fleet in to one of my systems, I want them to really suffer for it. Uh, Lingol, oh that's there, that's fine. It is sort of on the, the edge of our space, but it's not. You've got to go through our space to get to it on this side. What was that? Huh. They've left the Galactic Coalition. I guess things are getting a little bit sketchy. Okay. You guys properly defending the area. Nice. How are we doing down here? We're nearly... Oh, those little shardlings. Uh, we're nearly at the uh, the wormhole. It's improving our galactic knowledge. I mean, I'd be tempted to go in and clear out those shardlings. There's only a few of them. Research concluded. Yeah. The government civic screen presents us with information regarding our empire and its government. Here we can see our ruler and any related effects. Okay. This would be an interesting one. We've got one more civic pick that we could have. So actually this this could be very cool. Improve our admin capacity. Reduce our various costs. Yeah, let's uh, let's go for functional architecture. That's well worth it. And moving on from that, yeah, the heritage site. In fact, no, no, we'll uh, we'll do the living state. I want I want a black site star base. I have no idea what benefit it will give us, but definitely want one. Uh, how does Secundus? How are we doing on these? Yeah, we can. We can upgrade one of these. Defensive Pact Invitation. Aww, they will defend each other against all foes. Here goes our ship over to the wormhole. Space storms are amazing. I mean, this, this looks incredible. Research concluded. Can upgrade to citadels. Uh, improved strike craft, maybe. Yeah, let's let's do that. We're a bit low on food. Where does this go? Hmm. 
That goes all the way to their home world? Wow. It's a little bit awkward for them. Alright, uh, let's get you looking for the next one. In fact, I'm going to send you in here first to go kill those shardlings. And then we'll send you over here. So we're losing consumer goods a little bit now. Uh, that is going to swing back round as uh, Research various concluded. other buildings complete. Specifically, civilian industries. Particle Lance. Jeez. Uh, I think we'll go um, research alternatives next. Just so we've got more more options available. I do feel like we're we're powering way ahead of everyone else in terms of our research level and in fact let's let's have a look at the ship designer if we could turn it into the spinal mount one that's got that massive particle cannon on it receiving transmission hmm. over here City districts provide additional clerk jobs. That's very useful. So, Kegros Prime down here. Research concluded. I think we'll get civilian industries, and I would like to get some mining districts as well on Kegros Prime. Concluded. Uh, let's just buy Construction 500 project there. Concluded. We'll get two of those. Right, so society research is available, physics research is available. Uh, the physics research, of course, is giving us another option. Ooh, climate restoration. Or Paradise Dome. Uh, six housing, ten amenities. Yeah, let's uh, let's go climate restoration here and up here, planetary shield generators. Mm. I'm hoping that we'll we'll kill things before they get to the point of actually properly attacking us. Uh, we'll go general research speed, and the Gertwan platform is done. Uh, yeah, we're still not getting research concluded as much as I would like from here. Stormfire auto cannon. Uh, let's let's get more more minerals. We need more resources. You're still guarding our wormhole. Knowing that it comes from down here is actually really, really handy for us. Because those amoebas, they're basically just slipped right through. How much do we need? We need 10,000. Oh, and we've got to have Mega Engineering. Okay, so we, we don't need to save up right now. We do need to save up eventually, uh, but it's not as vital as I thought it might be. Awesome. Our economy is back in the black. Over on Inaris, 10 jobs, 7 housing. What do we want? We've obviously got lots of upgrades we can do. Maybe we'll get another exotic gas refinery.
Yeah, we'll get an exotic gas refinery. Population is 65. We could make it up to 70 something by getting another city district in there. But I'll hold off just for the moment. Oh, our envoy has died. I mean, they've been they've been improving our relations. We haven't really used our envoys much. Hey, minor military sanctions has passed, so we want more sanctions. Uh, minor military is done. Minor research is done. Minor economic sanctions. We're all about the sanctions. Uh, advanced Xeno studies. Observation posts provide additional society research. Uh, yeah. We're definitely going to support this. That's going to improve my diplomatic weight something chronic. Research concluded. I think it's probably going to be worth me getting some more alloys as well. Uh, that's improved our minerals coming out, which we definitely needed. Uh, we'll get Jurassic Armor. got enough food to last for a while so we don't need to really push that so yeah we'll get alloy foundries in fact if I filter that is being built and we can well we'll, we'll do something else in a while so the wormhole in Merce goes to the Dorellis system Okay, that's just down there. I wonder where this one goes. You guys have been great so far, but there is no need for you to risk yourself. They've got closed borders, so we can't go through there. We could go down here. With, uh, with so much money at the moment. I will start some of these other projects on the go. So we'll get this one also getting aloe foundries. Now these, these are not incredibly efficient. I mean, that's, that's pretty obvious. Uh, just from looking at them. Because we could uh, we could set up a proper mining place. I suppose this is the closest that uh... research concluded. Yeah, let's let's turn this into into a proper mining world. You can have three more mining districts there. Hey, the space storm has dissipated. That's amazing. Could lead to the eventual collapse of hyperspace network thousands of years in the future, but now space travel is back to normal, which is obviously the most important thing. Ooh. Increases the number of defense platforms that can be supported by eight. That's amazing. Um, 
I think we'll, we'll go for the extra research speed for now. Uh, over here, I think we're going to have to go for something to improve. Yeah, minerals from miners increase and minor jobs plus one. So this will become our mining world. And I'll be fine with that. Research concluded. Climate restoration. So this is going to allow us to terraform ecologically devastated worlds. So it's going to be worth us having a look and seeing if we can do anything worthwhile with that already. Uh, auto curating vault? No. Let's get galactic campaigns. And I want to have a look at planets and sectors. No, sorry, the expansion planner. Okay, so it's not saying anything, but that doesn't mean that there's nothing we can do. Uh, right, let's let's pause for a second. I mean, this is kind of unhelpful. Let's uh, let's go in and do them manually. So I wanted to check Haldus. Because I know we've got things like barren worlds. Alright. So we can't do those. That's a barren world. That's a gas giant. Which can't be done. I suspect that there's specific destroyed worlds that, uh, that we'd be able to do. But for now that remains out of reach. Research concluded. Duracell armor. I want to. I want to push towards the mega, mega, mega built. Actually, yeah. Let's get modular engineering. That's going to come along really quickly, and that's just going to improve the cost of everything we're doing. It's so like Guratran Station. We'll get another gun battery or two on here. How to second us? You can have another research lab. Uh, do we want to do that? I suppose we, we do. I mean, we always want to. So the Research Institute is good if you've already got it as as a research place. Uh, we're going to get another research thing here because we're already producing a lot and doubling down on that will make sense. Let's uh, close this. Uh, so the Elec 1 goes to the D41 Singularity. Alright. We could we could step through and claim that. I want to know what's up here. But uh, that will have to wait. Are there any other wormholes that we could have a look at that won't involve us like getting absolutely massacred? So you've got one here, which probably goes down to here. That'd be rather unfortunate for you. And I think that, that might be it. Okay, well, we'll send you back to our borders then. And uh, that's going to be it for this episode, I'm afraid. We are, unfortunately, out of time for the day. Ooh. Use of a giant being seen in the dark void of space is spreading across the Empire like a plague. There's concern and optimism wonder, but mostly brings an existential dread to the populace. Historical documents will record this day as one of the tremendous one of tremendous importance. Okay, well, with that, it is time to finish the episode. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. I do hope you have enjoyed this. 
Uh, if you have, be sure to give a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, go ahead and do so and you'll be told when the next episode goes live. Otherwise, I'll see you next time for some more Stellaris. See you soon.